popular launch viewing spot near the Port Jetty Park is closed because of Hurricane Nicole cleanup still, but right now spectators are packing into another spot just several miles away in Titusville, Space View Park. News 6 is Troy Campbell is live there for us tonight. Troy, some parks have already hit capacity. How are things near you? Oh, it's getting packed up uh, fairly quickly here uh, this evening. So they're all here at Space View Park, just across the causeway, of course. And we can actually see the rocket lit up. Um, we have the people here. They have their lawn chairs, of course, their snacks, everything they'll need for the next several hours. Excited ahead of the launch. Now, people are selecting their viewing locations all across the Space Coast ahead of that launch window beginning at 1 a.m. We've spoken with people who've traveled to the Space Coast from out of state for the launch. We also spoke with a family from England who planned their trip here five months ago. At the time, they thought they would have missed the original launch date, uh, but they're excited to see um, the launch actually happening in person. We also spoke with a man who recently moved to Florida after retiring from a job in California. Now, he says before he retired from his job in his career, he purchased and helped build some of the parts on the rocket. So he's excited to see his work in action. Take a listen. My last job, uh, I worked at a company that made valves that are all over this rocket. So I, I was a, a procurement agent out there and I personally bought a lot of parts that are on a lot of those valves. So. This is kind of cool for me to see this, my actual end product uh, in progress. And with several hours still until the launch, it's definitely getting pretty crowded here. I can tell you that at least all of the public parking spaces here are already filled. So you'll have to go into some of the private lots. We see people um, holding like their little cardboard signs, charging uh, of cash to park there. Um, so it's most undoubtedly uh, going to get more crowded here as this evening uh, progresses. Live in Brevard County tonight, Troy Campbell getting results. News 6. Oh,